Taneatua is a blink and you'll miss it small town of just over a thousand and it's home to a new sporting legend. 12-year-old Bailey Tepa Taro has just been crowned the new national golf champion at the Ames Games in Tauranga. Bailey scored 87 Stableford points from his three rounds at Mount Maunganui Golf Club. That means he sunk the ball well before the target score on each hole. An incredible achievement for any 12-year-old golfer. But wait for it, before his win, Bailey had only played three rounds of golf in his life. Bailey's also autistic, which means day-to-day -day activities can be difficult. Now he's led his team to victory against over 300 other schools from here and overseas, earning Tanea to a school their first gold medals in over a decade. It's such a great story. We were so excited to speak to Bailey and his coach Fetu this afternoon. Now Bailey is a man of few words, but we asked him how he felt after that huge win. I feel happy. Hey, what do you what do you like about golf? I always like about drive by doing the drivers club. <laughs> drivers. What's cool about Fetu? It's a cool about Fitu because he teaches me how to whack a golf ball. Mm. Where I have to aim, where I have to aim, where I have to aim for. So guys, how hard is it for a, a school like yours to actually get to these games? Um, yeah, it is hard, it is challenging. Um, I think, yeah, the most challenging part is, um, yeah, like what you said, trying to, trying to get there. Because um, we, we're a small community school, we don't have much kids to choose from going to the Ames, Ames game, so it's not really, um, you know, of choice sometimes. Um, sometimes it's, it's fully out of our control, so um, to get two teams, our nipple team and our golf team back at the, back at the Ames games was, yeah, a super proud moment for our school and our community. Tēnā kōrua, we're, we're so super proud. How did you manage to learn with, with no golf course? Um, we actually had to travel out, uh, out of our little community into Whakatane, um, which is not that long of a drive, 15, 20 minutes at the max. Yeah, awesome. Um, so we, we travelled there, um, the, the school um, shouted the kids of, of some memberships to go and practice at the course. So I just took them out whenever I could during, during and after school hours to go practice before the Ames games. Oh, kia ora. Bailey, darling, what do your mates at school think about it? Because I'm always winning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're super proud of Bailey. I um, bet they are. Heaps of support for him. Hey, Bailey, uh, do you think you could show us your golf swing now? OK. Well, Bailey, you're a legend, and Fetu, I think that you probably are too. Thank you both for talking to us tonight. Thank you, Thank you fellas. Well, no, Mikey, the co but welcome to the project. This is cool. Te Pāti Māori co-leader Debbie Ngārua Packer is our co-host tonight. Yeah. Uh, the first of our political leaders to join us in the lead up to the election, so no pressure to get it right. <laughs> and uh, hey, how cool was that story? I think you know that town, right? Yeah, yeah, I do. It's really awesome. It reminds me of the town I'm from in Pātea in, in Taranaki. So. What was your big talent as a 12 year old girl? Um, probably I did speeches and I. I the tap dancing as well. Ooh. Sorry, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> right, okay, we need to wind over to the next one. <laughs> Did you say you want to give us a tap dancing? <gasps> no, that's great. <laughs> I don't know. I think my mum knew the, the, the teacher, and anyway, somehow I ended up there in yeah. a tutu. Speeches and, tap, <laughs> speeches and tap dancing, pretty good practice for politics, though, by the way, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, there it is. It, it's, um, yeah, you certainly know how to tap dance your way through a few things. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> awesome.